Hello and welcome you all to another interesting video brought to you by TechStreet. And as usual, I'm Pramukh, your host for today. So in this video, we'll be talking about how to download and install Microsoft Office package for free. I know most of you will think that this I'm using some uh, cracking software, but I must say that this method is 100% legit. So we are not using any cracking or patching software into this. We are using a 100% legal or legit method to get our Microsoft Office package set up into our computer. So without wasting much time, let's see how we can do that. Welcome back. So I must tell you that there are some prerequisites you must uh, fulfill to get this. So you need to have a Microsoft email. So I'm not talking about the free email that we can get simply registering in this uh, Microsoft Office account. As an example, most of the universities provide these emails. So once you get registered with a university or a college, most of them provide uh, the students with a Microsoft email and also it's not a mandatory requirement that you should have it uh, because from one email we can get five license keys so if one of your friends or one of your siblings or whatever the your closed ones have this you can ask them and get this done so that's a must otherwise you cannot use this okay now let's go to office.com as you can see uh, there's an interface appearing if you are watching this video after several years uh, the interface might be different but I hope you can uh, find the things then they will ask you to type your email address so as you can see this is the email address I have created for uh, the free email address I have created so we cannot use this email we have to use the email address provided by UI Education Institute and click next and they will ask you to enter the password and and some pop-ups are coming okay so this will be the interface that it's appearing uh, I'm, I'm repeating again this might be different if you are doing this after several years for now this is the interface that appearing and uh, you can see which says install office this is very simple just click this off install office button and there's something called uh, office 365 apps just click it and you can see some file has been downloaded into my computer just click this file and uh, it started getting downloaded so for the moment I have already installed office into my computer I'm simply closing this so simply click it and it will uh, download straight away and uh, it will cost like 5 to 6 gigs I mean the gigabytes so that's the only cost you will get charged okay so we have installed completed installing Microsoft Office package and the next one this is the most important one we have to license our product so for that you need to simply open any of the office applications uh, so in this case I'm opening uh, word since I have already set up my uh, things uh, I'm getting this one so you will get a bit different one but don't worry then uh, click this account button in your case uh, some message will appear like this sign in to set up office so in this stage you have to click this sign in button and then they will ask you to enter the email address and password all you have to do is enter the email which we used before and uh, enter the password also so then it will process automatically and the license key will be applied to your office and then uh, it shows something like this subscription product says Microsoft Office 365 Pro Plus and uh, likewise you can see and uh, afterwards you are office I mean uh, all of his products will be uh, lightened so with that uh, 
the live sharing part is over okay i will uh, tell you few more things just go to these uh, other install options so you can see you can install office on up to five pcs or max five tablets and five smartphones so this is the advantage that's the reason why i told you that it's not a mandatory requirement that you should have uh, this email uh, if you're a friend or anyone you know you can ask them if they like they will help you and uh, let's see devices we have already using we have already logged in using this email and once we click this view apps and devices it shows something like this and when this when we click this drop down it shows the devices we have already signed in using this email so we can see how it's working and the devices we have using i hope you enjoyed the video and you got some knowledge out of this and that's it don't forget to like share and comment your ideas and all the things uh, which came into your mind after watching this and also if you still haven't subscribed to our channel and please do like and subscribe to our channel and also don't forget to press the bell icon for the latest updates and that's it stay safe and have a great day